Now here in part one, we are going to complete the sentences using there is and there are. It could be in affirmative or negative form, cualquiera de las dos formas, affirmative or negative. In the second part, you're going to complete with interrogative form. This is interrogative form. Fíjense aquí hay a, any, plural. ¿Qué cosa iría aquí? In part number three, we are going to complete the sentences about your neighborhood. About your neighborhood, tu vecindario. Try to use the words from the box. Estas palabras, traten de usarlas en sus oraciones. There is, there isn't, there are, there aren't here. Aquí colocan hay o no hay. Todas son oraciones afirmativas o negativas. No hay ninguna interrogativa. Aquí tenemos expressions. A ver, across the street, cruzando la calle. Around the corner, a la vuelta de la esquina. Across from my house, frente a mi casa. Near my house, cerca a mi casa. Down the street, bajando la calle, la parte de abajo. On my street, en mi calle. Ten minutes away, a ten, diez minutos de aquí. One on the, on the next block. En la siguiente cuadra. So use these expressions in this part. Pueden repetirlas. Todo es de acuerdo a tu vecindario. So complete these sentences. Then you send me a picture of this page. Because I want to check part one, number two, and part three. Okay, send your pictures to the WhatsApp group. No es necesario que salga esta parte o esta parte de aquí. Lo que quiero revisar es la parte 1, 2 y 3. Ok. So, send your pictures.